A program designed to help low-income residents pay their heating bills is running low on money. The Northeast Community Action Cooperation is a 12-county area organization that has been helping the disadvantaged since 1965. They hope to achieve that again this winter. Bitterly cold air has brought record cold temperatures to the Midwest. When asking local residents why they thought the budget was low, the response was not surprising. I feel like people would be donating more to other causes such as food drives possibly because, I mean, I personally agree with that and believe that food is more important than heating and cooling in order to survive. Those in need often have to choose between paying utility bills and paying for food and medicine. And 300 more applications have been turned in this year than last. It starts October 1st for elderly and disabled, and then November 1st it opens up to the rest of the community, anyone who's income eligible for it, and then it ends in March. Assistance is supposed to be available through March, but the organization said it ran out of money as early as January last year. If you're looking to spread some holiday cheer this season, the gift of warmth is exactly what the Northeast Community Action Cooperation is hoping for. The NECAC agency administers assistance based on income, the number of people per household, and the type of heating source. It takes 30 days between when someone applies and when they are approved. I think that charity begins with your community and your, and your people around you. Uh, please donate to any charity if it's going to be make you feel better. The Northeast Community Action Cooperation assisted around 4,000 people with their utility bills last winter. If you would like more information on how to donate to this organization, you can go to necac.org or call 636-272-3477. For LUTV News, I'm Brianna Miller.